Hey there, Matt Petrowski here. I just wanted to show you how you could do a free and easy world clock. I know there are paid versions, but I thought this was pretty cool. You can see what I have right here where I've got a list of all the different areas and so on. So the first thing you're going to need as I switch over to preferences aren't loaded. Okay, let's get the preferences loaded. There we go, system preferences. This right here is what you're looking for, Geek Tool. You can see that as I zoom in. It's basically a little preference pane. What it allows you to do is put things on your desktop such as a world clock. So when I click on this, basically all of these little widgets that are just floatable, you can drag them to wherever you want them. I normally put this on another monitor. You can get rid of it by clicking this. You can resize it by dragging this, depending on whatever the output is. Here you've got this little control of all these different settings or the properties. You can see right here that you can actually create a file, an image, or a shell. I believe this was a shell. So I've got the world clock position. You don't really need to set those unless you drag this. It's part of a default group. You can create different groups, turn those groups on and off, etc. But basically right here is what we're looking at, this command right here, where you can see that I am running a command that is something that you would normally do in the terminal. So if this scares you, don't use this technique. Otherwise, it should be pretty straightforward. And here it is. It's basically a script. I forget where I got the original script, um, but basically I modified something. I might have found it on Stack Overflow. Here is a URL that you can actually go to right here for the different time zones. Let me throw that up on screen for you. That's at wikipedia.org wiki-list of TZ database time zones. And what that's going to do is it's going to give you all the different time zones that you want to use, which are those right there. So basically you're just going to create these little uh, suffixes or prefixes or excuse me abbreviations like uh, PT for Pacific Time, CT for Central Time, ET for Eastern Time, AT Australia, etc. This one doesn't exist. ID for uh, America Boise. But anyway, you're passing the date command and this formatting is available if you look at the man page for the date command and you're able to put the date in whatever format you want and then down here at the bottom you can see all these lines where I echo, 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 echo. You simply just echo out, with, echo out whichever ones you want to print within that uh, little dialog area and that's how you can get a really cool world clock very easily. System takes care of it, Geek Tool shows it, and that's how you do it. You can go through all the rest of the settings. I hope that helps you out. See you later.